Okay. Open the gate. Other way. Ah. Who's this guy? Master Geralt. A guard spotted you from the tar. They sent me to open the gate. Why was it closed? Is that famous Skellige hospitality? Me. Tis tradition. After the feast, the Jarls will choose the king, so the doors must remain closed. Only the sons and daughters of Skellige may stay in the castle. Hmm. So Krak made an exception for me? Krak make an exception just for me? All know what you did for Ceres and Yalmar. Today, you're one of us. Cool. Come. Krak awaits. How's the mood in there? Calm. Too calm. How's that? We've an adage here at Skellige. At a good feast, meat and blood flow in equal measure. Surely you consider this barbaric on the continent? No, not sure. Sounds preferable to dull banquets garnished with court intrigue. Step careful there. Hmm, to the point. I've as much right to it as you do. And I'd expect you to support me. Not pinch my allies. If an aunt trades to wear the crown, it should be you. Because you've got fur growing on your chin, that it. Show some of your own, and the Jarls just might listen to you. Watch your mug smacked. Remember, I was left standing last time we crossed fists. <laughs> yeah? So you'll fight the Vilkards with me? Wonder who'll do better? You? Or Yalmar, the giant slayer? Oh, stop your shite, Boston. <laughs> Zeros. Hey! God damn it! That didn't play that well. Bad way to play it out. Think I don't know that. But you saw her. She's so, so uh, stubborn, fierce, mule-headed, refuses to listen to anyone. Exactly. Hmm. Reminds you of anybody? <laughs> <laughs> True, Arnvald. Me and Zeros. Well, they're twins in that regard. Oh, there's a wolf just there. Are you talking to the Jarls? No, went to his chambers. To prepare your promised reward, no doubt. If you've a spell witch, or perhaps you'd fancy some fisticuffs with the Vilkarls. Loosen up your joints after your journey. Maybe later. Yeah, I think you can punch up. Why not? And he just walked through that guy. Hello, Wolfie. How you doing? Greetings, Berna. Feast not to your liking. This is no feast. It's a farmer's market where votes are bought and sold like sheepskins. Hmm. Svanrig is not gonna vie for support. Bran's son will not haggle for a crown that is his by right. Far as I know, crown goes to the claimant who gains the most votes. That is the tradition, but not all traditions are good. The Isle's care should be entrusted to a single family. Hmm. What's wrong with voting for your king? Take a walk. Listen and you'll understand. The claimants already hand out land, promise privileges, titles, favorable judgments. They behave like whores lifting their skirts for every passerby. A king by the grace of votes is no ruler, but a debtor. This must end. We must start by placing Bran's firstborn son on the throne. I hope the Jarls will see the wisdom of it. Hmm. Leaving Kertrolda? Tomorrow at daybreak. Enjoy yourself, Master Geralt. Oh, well, uh, hello, Elite. You, what are you doing? Changing you into May Cosmo I? the Follower. You must even <laughs> come. I've been waiting for you. So, feast to your liking. Any better than your, your problems, continent dude. <laughs> balls. Definitely more to drink. Ah, there is. Rolled all of it out of my cellars. Double meads, triple, Cintrian plum brandy. 
The Hakamum spirit that burns a mouth like boiling water. Clan on Crate knows the meaning of hospitality. Hmm. Something tells me there's a purpose to your hospitality. Aye, there is. In the Isles, mead and meat stand to gain you as much support as feats accomplished blade in hand. If that's true, you can rest easy about how the vote'll turn out. I'll rest easy on the morrow, when the crown rests on one of my children's heads. Hmm. Yeah, so we talked about Bilma about. What about? Politics. After all, North Elf's interests her. Wench tried to convince me that we must honor Brand's memory. And to that aim, I'm to command my offspring to withdraw from the race for the crown. Supports Farnrigger instead. Why do I think you turned her down? <laughs> you put it mildly. I showed her the door. Yeah. Feeling torn between Yalmar and Ceres? You mean, do I have a favorite? Nay. They're as different as fire and water. But on crate blood flows in both. Hmm. <laughs> You've had some issues in Twitch. Well, I don't think everyone has issues in Twitch from time to time. Between you and me, Yalmar's not too hot-headed to be king. Depends on the kind of king you have in mind. Want one who'll send emissaries, move figurines about a map, calculate the most profitable option? And yes, he's too hot-headed. Hmm. But Skelliger wants a different ruler. The kind who'll drown Nilfgaard in blood. Sooner jump into a fire than surrender. And that is Yalma. If you escalate your attacks, you stand to infuriate Amir. Could regret it someday. In Skelliger. We spit on the notion of peace at any cost. Hmm. Nice. Uh, I think the Council of Jarls will dare to put a woman on the throne. If you'd asked me some months ago, I'd have laughed in your face. <laughs> so what's changed? But today I see, and I'm not alone, that Ceres has something as rare on the Isles as a hot summer. Patience. Others act, then think. She's different. She thinks things through, the for, the against. But once she takes action, not a force in the world could stop her. Hmm. Let's talk about the reward. You promised me a reward for helping your children. And I aim to keep my word. Here. This bauble's been in the family for generations. I give it to you. A bauble? For helping ensure the line endures. Oh, just, oh okay. It's a sword bauble. <laughs> Beautiful craftsmanship. Thanks. I'm the one. <laughs> oh, okay. Hear that? Damn it. That must be we started another row. That's not Yalmar. Let's go. Something's really something, something's really going on in there. That doesn't sound good. Whoa! Holy shit! What the hell? There's two of the damn things. Cause I am. Kill the bear! I need a new rug anyway. There's three of them! Hi! Ah! Oh, on fire! Burn, baby, burn! What the hell happened? Cloth! Give me some cloth! Gotta stop the bleeding! Quick! 
Da. Da. Take my cloak. He's dead. Hold on, son. You'll pull through. A shark grabbed my leg once. Albion! He's dead. <laughs> Crack! Where'd those bears come from, huh? Answer! Now! Careful how you speak to my dad. Stow your blade, pup! Or Crack will lose a son, too! You insult me, Lugas! And now you threaten my son! I will not step on his. How dare you? Come on! Put you down like a rabbit dog! Calm down! Calm down! Enough blood's been spilt. Someone brought these beasts here to murder our sons and brothers. Mm. We cannot restore their lives. But we can. We must avenge them. This burden falls upon the host and his offspring. Find the guilty on crate. Find and kill them. Else your clan will be cursed for a hundred generations to come. Well, that sounds serious. Hmm. Yeah, anybody see how the bears got in? Anybody see how the bears got in? Don't matter. I know where to find the guilty already. Wait? Are you mad? You're gonna kill folk before we've learned what happened. Learn all you want. Meantime. I'll go wash the shame of our clan. Hey, the Yarls aren't listening anymore. Stop playing the hero and think for a second. Our honor's at stake, sis. I can't wait. Are you listening to me? Someone let those bears in. We must know who, and the answer lies somewhere in this room. She's got a point. You're right, Ceres. I'll help you. Thanks. Fine. See you when I return with the traitor's heads. I'll stay here. Someone must see to everything. Someone the healer hand the fallen over to their families. Wolf, I thank you. Cool. All right. Ever see anything like that? No, and I hope I never will again. Where'd the bears come from? We were all laughing, eating, drinking. Suddenly, a massacre. The police came and said, "Who's been eating my dinner?" <laughs> what happened before the massacre? Be precise. Y young Lucas bet he could empty a barrel of beer in one go. He climbed on the table, grabbed a pony keg of centrin wheat, and started chugging. His throat bulged like a blowfish. Face went red, but he kept drinking. Folks started banging their tankers on the table, shouted, Lucas. Yeah, we heard that Lugos. bit. Then, from the other side of the room, we heard this roar. We turned in unison as if a coxswain had called. They were there. They were already there. Folks closest to the bears didn't even manage to draw their weapons. They... They were ripped to shreds. We'll avenge them. I promise. Okay, let's we look around. Enough. Let's look around. Let me know what you find. I'll speak to the others. Maybe someone saw more than I did. Hmm. Oops, wrong button. Pull yourself together, Senna. How'd they get in? I don't know. The gates were shut. Fang marks, claw marks, broken bones. Hard to say what exactly killed him. How about a bear? <laughs> a very fucking large bear. <laughs> Saw a bear standing by the bench. Does the gods do it? Maybe they're punishing us. Dragadar. It's called Plage's last. All right. What do we have here? A bear with an apple? Bear's head, but the tongue's short, like a human's. A were bear? Mouth smells of honey liqueur. Oh my god! Me. It's a toy from the eighty from the nineties. A were bear. Earthy. Bears like honey. Before it's fermented. Strange. Hmm. Something under the fur. A tattoo? 
Shape of a bear paw. Old scar. Looks like it was sutured. Half man, half bear. Something like a lycanthrope. No full moon, so something else caused the transformation. Maybe something he ate, or drank. Mead. Mead with an earthy aroma. Need to check the horns, tankards, and bowls. Uh -huh. Young Lugos. Bears took him by surprise. Didn't have a chance to defend himself. Oh. The horns are empty. Okay. CSI Witcher here. Do do do. Bodies massacred. Hard to tell who it is. Stangrim, maybe? Aldrig. Shit, no more than a kid. Hmm, can't examine the, this bear. Okay. Oop. table mead in this one and only mead okay what's this one here mead spiked with some kind of mushroom and human blood Ceres, come here Look this. Those weren't bears. They were men who transform into bears. Uh huh. Berserkers. 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 The skull's name for warriors who change into animals in the midst of battle. Stuff of fairy tales, legends. But it seems to make sense, right? Mm hmm. Almost. We were at a feast, not on a battlefield. I think I know what caused them to transform. The mead they drank. Smell this. Mead spiked with blood. And something else. Thinking it could be a mushroom, but I don't recognize the type. Yort might help us. Few druids know herbs better. Can't hurt to try. Uh -huh. Mother. May the sea swallow the traitors. Freya, Our Lady. Mind if I interrupt? Already have? What is it? Someone <laughs> spiked one of the mead barrels with blood and something else. An herb or a mushroom. Sarah said, Give me the horn. Give you the horn? Well, if you're sure. Uh, oh, sorry. <clears throat> a mushroom. Mardrom. Mardrom? Mardrom related in any way to berserkers? Aye. But only in the tales told to children as they are put to sleep on cold winter nights. <coughs> Warriors who ate Mardrom Lovely. were said to transform into beasts when consumed by battle rage. But as I said, it's only... Only a legend, I know. Still, I find it easier to believe than some story about bears appearing out of nowhere. Yes, yeah, so I can see that now. Good night, kids. By the way, you can drink this magic po potion and turn you over into scary bears. Yes, good night, kids. Don't worry about that. <laughs> Mardrum. Never ah! heard of it. You have another name for it on the continent. Silas I believe. All right. Hasn't seen it to soothe pain. Udalric tried it too, but only a few times. In larger doses, the mushroom causes visions, nightmares. Yes, the last thing Udalric needed more of. Thanks for your help. Blood and marjoram. The taste of human flesh and a substance that triggers visions. That well could have caused the rage. Maybe even the transformation. Maybe. Mm. Hard to believe someone spiked the mead here in the hall, though, in front of all those witnesses. You're right. I helped prepare for the feast. I'd have noticed. 
might have happened before they brought the drink upstairs. In the cellars, maybe? Come on, we could find some clues there. Actually, whilst I remember, hang on. I got the sword, didn't I? It's a silver sword called Fate. Oh, we've got two death winds. What's this? No, okay. Oh, we need to, let's put some thingies in. Uh, there you go. So if, if there's a two percent chance to freeze, poison, and set fire to them. Cool, we've got matching blades now. Sort of. Do 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 do. Follow her to the cellar. Do 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 do. We must find the traitors quickly. Elsewise, the warriors will take matters into their own hands. Castles are buzz already. Think they'd attack Croc openly? My father or each other? All in the finest Skellige tradition. Haven't had a good civil war in ages. <laughs> That's right. Civil war. Purge the people. Purge them all. Why fight other people when you can fight amongst yourselves? Knew there'd be trouble. It was all too calm. Funny. Whoops. Oh, what the hell? Said the same. Fell on the stairs. For a feast to be any good, needs gotta flow, and so does blood. I'd say he got his wish. Do 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 do. Jeez, this is taking forever. I hope Yalmar is doing something useful, not just looking for a fight. Relax. Your brother's impetuous, not stupid. You sure about that? He did go up against a giant. We keep the poison at the cellar's other end down below. Come, I'll show you. Spirit. Someone ruined several barrels of the finest. Good thing Dad's got other worries at it. Right Oops. behind you. That's a relief. Hmm. Aha. Blood and mushrooms. Think we can find out where this barrel came from? Looks different. What the? Uh oh. The spirit. There's another exit up in the barrel, but they're too heavy. We'll never move them. Don't intend to. That's right. We don't need to move them. For I have hard. Uh, I didn't select it. Shazam! Follow her through the tunnel. Oh, come on. What? We might have been burned alive. Somebody's damn desperate to bring our investigation to a quick end. This is a secret passage. One rarely used, more like. When Yalmar and I were little, we'd play here. Once. Ugh. Ooh, to shrine. of power. Should draw from it. Nice. Got an ability point. Uh -huh. Excuse me, love, while I just sort this. Um, there we go. What's Quen? Oh, he's actually used the shield. Ah, okay. Can never remember the damn things, the name of the damn things.
Do, 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 do. When I get my hands on that pyromaniac. Let's think. They had to use the entrance we used. Maybe they left some prints behind. Maybe. When the door slammed shut, okay. the fire See broke you out. See you later, Lee. Did you hear a bottle shatter too? No, <laughs> but I have no witcher sense at my disposal. You must hear the hair growing on my head. <laughs> I try not to eavesdrop. Anyway, entrance is worth checking. Come on. Ooh. Keep doing that. Awesome bread, lovely. Ah. Someone walked through the mead. There we go. <laughs> Could you ask for clearer prints? Sticky from the mead. Trail breaks off. Need to find another clue nearby. Something else to follow. Must have felt his clothing rip, but was in a hurry. What's this? Piece of cloth. No, it can't be. What is it? Arnfeld's tunic. Only he wears this kind. Sure about that? Saw him in the main hall with the servants. Let's hmm. go. Out the way. <laughs> Grab a horse. We'll chase him down. Faster. Go. When I get my hands on him. Out of way. Don't stand a chance. Where to see your boy ducks. Gotcha. Come on now. <laughs> Why do you betray them? Talk or I'll finish what I started. No on crate should ever sit on Skellige's throne. I know you better than others do. You're hot-headed, irresponsible. Skelliger needs stability. A strong king. Not the kind a band of drunken Jarls will choose. Curious. Never heard you voice that idea. But I do know one who never stops saying it. It's Bernard Bran, isn't it? You were never uh -huh. involved. <laughs> of course. What was her motive? It's obvious. She schemed this up to get rid of the other claimants. Slander or clan of the process. If she succeeded, Svanriga would have been left. The only claimant to Skellige's throne. We need proof. Your word against Berna's, that's not enough. Anvald, help us. And I'll ask my dad to grant you an honorable death. I'll insist. I have letters from her. Instructions. How to poison the mead. But she never signed them. There's no seal. Will that be enough? It'll have to be. We shouldn't delay. Time to gather the orals. I've assembled the Jarls in council as you demanded, Ceres on Crate. You claim to know who's behind the slaughter at Kaer Trolda. Speak then. The blood of Skellige's sons and daughters. Whose hands does it stain? Bernard Brands. <laughs> the last is mad. Do you think anyone will believe you? You had them serve poison meat to the berserkers. I beg your pardon. The servants of Kaer Trolda are not mine to command. T'was your father who called for the feast, who assembled the guests. There's reason in these words. Have you any proof to confirm your accusation? I've better. I've a witness. Arnvald. Sarah speaks true. Bernard commanded me to poison the maid. When Cerys and the Witcher descended into the cellars, you 
betrayed us. The clan that took you in! Good man. He's a servant to Uncreate, a lackey. He will say what they command him to say. He would lie for them even were he to pay for it with his head. Werner speaks true. Arnvald has served a care trolder ever since I remember. Loyally, look a dog. Got one more piece of evidence. Hmm. A letter from Berna to Arnvald, instructing him how to spike the meat. It lacks my signature. It lacks my seal. But perfume soaked through the parchment. A very strong scent, you know. Still to be Aha! <laughs> Is this your proof, lass? Is this what you call evidence of my supposed treason? Don't make me laugh. Burn is right, Saris. Tis all precious little proof of her wrongdoing. Alas, your brother Hjalma also has not presented anything that could clear your family's name. We've but one path left to us. Holger, Lugos, it's time we quit this damn castle. Come, we must decide what punishment Clan on Crate will face. You're making a big mistake. You're making a big mistake. Silence, wanderer. Wait! Mother, you bade me to leave the hall before the feast. Why? Son, not now. Why did Aha. you know? How did you know? Hi! You stand silent. You gave Ceres no credence. Give the Witcher no credence, but you must give credence to a son who accuses his own mother. The massacre was her doing. She shamed herself, me, the family, the clan. Svanrika, I did it for you. Only of course, for you. it's always the you son. Admit to this deed. As the eldest of the Jarls. I cleanse the name of Clan on Creep, and you, Berna Bran, I sentence to death. You Immediately. Chained to, a rock <sighs> to perish of hunger and thirst, and sea fowl will peck apart your remains. Ha <laughs> ha. Well, that was actually quite good. I actually quite like that. That's quite cool. Lust for power. I knew this, but so strong as to commit such a crime. What about Svanriga? What's his fate? He'll lose his home, his name, his honor. He'll choose exile or death. Exile's good. But enough. Whatever comes, we must endure. I thank you, Geralt. Again. Yeah, I keep bailing your ass out. Again. I'll not take any more of this modesty. <laughs> this is a land of heroes. Let this remind you of that. And now, I must ride for Gedinate, for the Jarl's council. Time to pick a king. What do you think? Who'll get the nod? Come with me. See for yourself. All may listen to our deliberations. Okay. I do have a horse in the race. Can't refuse, to be honest. As I thought. Well, let's go. I'll say one thing for the Witcher, you know, the quests are interesting, you know, as opposed to sort of get, go over here, get this, go over here, get, do that, go over here, kill this person. The stories behind, the sort of, the, the the story behind all the different quests, the different sort of um, characters you meet, just in time. make it really interesting. Started. You can see why it won so many awards. I probably, I probably said that already. Ah, I see. So because I backed her, she becomes queen, huh? I 
know some would see another in my place. Damn right. I thank those who stood at my side. Here, beneath the sacred oak, I pledge to be a good queen to the ones and the others. I want peace and Oops. prosperity to reign in Skellige. And I count on you to help me fulfill that dream. Service! 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 Oh dear. Yay! Right. Hooray! 